very much for coming Thanks down. For but uh, Herbie, what's this? You're with a horse right now? Uh, Dami, you're going to be with the horse here in just a matter of minutes. We appreciate you uh, interviewing Brian McBride. It should be interesting to see him get back. Now, the Ohio State men's gymnastics team out to win the national title. Beginning this Thursday, Ohio State will host the NCAA gymnastics meet at St. John Arena. Joined in studio by Ohio State's Jamie Natalie and Raj Bavsar. Drill that one, right? And we also want to bring in Dom Tiberi. And Dami, Dami's been working on this all week long. He's been over at St. John Arena. He's been telling us that he's, he's been practicing getting up on the pommel horse. And tonight, we're going to see it. You're, you're, yeah, in a minute. Well, let's talk to the professionals right, talk right the now. They've got the national championship it's coming up stuff. at St. John. First of all, we want to fill St. John, right, guys? Right. Absolutely. Um, having a lot of people there is really important. Um, the more people we get, the more we'll feel like we're at home. It'll just help us do better to go out there and win. All right. Yeah, defending national champ, Jan Jamie Natalie, uh, we're going to repeat this year? Not only you, but then the team, right? Yeah, the team titles first and foremost. Last year we didn't win the team title, unfortunately, and even though I won the individual title, I wasn't as, as pleased as, as the team title would have been. So, I mean, that's all of our goals. Hopefully we can just go out there and beat every other team. You know, I, I asked these guys when we were at break, I said, realistically this weekend, wh what is the goal? Everybody talks about winning championships, but you guys feel that this is a realistic goal for the team. Uh, definitely. I mean, with this team, it's, I mean, it's never been a better year. If this is the year we're going to do it, then this, it's going to happen. Like, realistically, this team can and most likely will win. You know what? It seems like the, the gymnastics teams over the years, always competitive. You guys have been on some great teams. Is this team any different from some of the other great teams you've been a part of? Um, yeah, we've been, I've been here for four years, and we've been great every year, but this team's really seemed to come together the past month, month or so, and I mean, we're as close as a, a team as I've ever been on, so if we just go out there and do what we can do, we should win. Great. All right. Now, you know, you, you've been talking about whether or not I can do gymnastics. This is my friend, the horse. M move over, guys. This is my friend. This is the horse. And uh, earlier today, I was actually trying to help these guys so they can win a national title this year. I kind of showed them a little bit about the horse. Can, can we roll the tape, please, of me? That's it. What, what else can I say, Herb? You saw it. You're an athlete. That's it. You know, you saw it. Now, now, who's the best on the pommel here amongst you two? <laughs> Jamie or Raj? Raj, go ahead. Show us a little bit. Come on over here. Go over there and just tell us what we're seeing here, uh, Jamie. Do a little, do a little uh, announcing here for us. Go ahead. Get on there and do it. Uh, this is just a basic move called a circle. It's the basic element in the routine. Um, these are what you call scissor movements that are required. It's tough to do with uh, sweats on, right? Oh, absolutely, but he's performing them excellently. He is. Yeah, if it's tough to do that with uh, that on, how about a suit? Yeah. I did it in a suit. You did great earlier, Don. All right, very good. Look at that. And that's a hand thing this smell. Not bad. I'll work with you later, Raj. Huh? Hey, guys, right. thanks for coming down. Don't go away. We'll, we'll see some more of your stuff. Don't forget the NCAA championship beginning at St. John Arena this coming Thursday. Get out and support these guys. They're looking to win the national title. But we've got to take a break right now. Uh, you know, baseball is ready to begin. Finally, baseball's here. When we come back, we'll look at the Reds and the Indians. Wall to Wall Sports will continue. Got a cash allowance. So it's just the key is just yeah. hand over hand like that. Yeah, he's doing pretty good. But if you're nice to me, yeah. I'll you show you how to do it. I'll, I'll break it down a little bit. Maybe, okay. you know, you were a quarterback, but when it comes to gymnastics, I mean, uh, I, come uh, on. Hands off. Yeah. You know, tomorrow is opening day for both the Cincinnati Reds. Wall to Wall Sports, the curtain has fallen on what has been a very successful season for the Blue Jackets. We'll relive the season. Jeff Hogan will go one on one with team owner John McConnell. Spring practice is heating up for the Buckeyes. Quarterback coach Joe Daniels and special teams coach Ken Kanatzer will join us in studio. Former Buckeye Ricky Dudley has signed on with the Cleveland Browns. Our Ryan Miller will visit with him. Congratulations go out to the OSU men's gymnastics team. The national champion Buckeyes are in the house. So break out your green jacket. Wall to wall sports is next. Two gymnastics, the Ohio State men's gymnastics team still celebrating its third national championship. 
And, you know, it certainly helps when you have two gymnasts in the United States, uh, the top two gymnasts in the United States on your team. Jamie Natalie uh, was the overall men's competition winner on Friday night. Raj Bobzar finished second. Then last night, Bobzar won the individual title on the parallel ball, and Ohio State's Darren Lynch took home the vault title. We are joined now in studio by the 2001 national champion Ohio State Buckeyes, fellas. Congratulations. Hey, congratulations. Uh, national great. champion. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Miles, just put into words, I mean, this is the second one you've been a part of. First time as a head coach. You won the uh, other one a couple years ago with Pete Corman as a head coach, but this one's yours. You're the it's, head coach. It's special. You know, in the program, you know, Andy Geiger, Archie turns the brains over to you. You certainly don't want this tradition and everything that's so special at Ohio State to, to go down the drain. And, and obviously it didn't. Uh, we certainly kept that, that alive and, and obviously Big Ten and national champions. You had uh, a lot of expectations. We just had you in last week talking about this and I think you guys realized, we asked you what your real realistic goal was and you said we're going to win this thing. Uh, looking at that and, and looking at, at the individual performance by some of your, uh, some of your athletes, it, it had to be gratifying to have those expectations and then to see it come to fruition. Absolutely. I mean, we started in September, uh, first team meeting talked about, hey, we're going to lose some this year. The, the total goal of this season was to win the Big Ten Championship, and win the National Championship. Those things and, and the preparation to get there to do those things is all we, we talk about. Not actually winning, but the preparation for the ultimate goal of winning. Jamie Natalie can't be, couldn't be here tonight, but uh, he was phenomenal on Friday. Just talk about him, what he meant. He absolutely, he meant a lot. I mean, a great deal. He was the top gymnast ranked coming into that competition, and he, he did exactly that to, to finish that competition. Obviously, Oklahoma and no one else, uh, how, no matter how much noise they talk, they couldn't come back from... Talking from a lot of noise, yeah. weren't they? And they were, and they certainly were. Did, Ron, did that provide motivation for you guys, the fact that Oklahoma's coming into your building talking trash about how they're going to take care of you guys? Absolutely. It psyched me up and it psyched this whole team up. You know, no team is going to come into St. John Arena and talk trash. You know, it's not going to happen. And especially with the fire in this team, we were not going to lose that meet. Can, can Darren Lynch, you, you come on in here too. Now, you won the vault championship, what, uh, Saturday night, last night? Yep. All right, just put into words, what's it mean? National champs. Uh, it was just great. Um, we, we fought the whole night, and it was just a great night for college gymnastics and to the Buckeyes. Hey, thank you very much for coming down, Miles. Back Congratulations. To hey, you, Congratulations to all thank you guys. Thank you. Uh, too, guys. Thank you. Fabulous. When we come back, Tiger Woods adds a green jacket to his collection. That's right, and Ryan Miller sits down with the newest member of the Cleveland Browns, former Buckeye Ricky Dudley. We'll be right back. Yeah, I'm just gonna...